As we embark on a journey through the world of luxury, join us in exploring the life of Bernard Arnault, the second richest person in the world and a key figure in the world of extravagance. In this episode of Luxury Queens, we'll uncover eight fascinating facts about Bernard Arnault, showcasing his influence and success in the realm of opulence and sophistication. Let's dive into the story of this influential figure, celebrating his legacy with an appreciation for luxury and achievement. But before that, kindly show us some love by liking this video, subscribing to our channel, and hitting that notification bell to get updated with our latest content. Get ready for an inside look at the man behind the luxury empire of Louis Vuitton. Number one, Bernard Arnault is worth $200.7 billion, according to Forbes.com. Bernard Arnold, who currently serves as chairman and CEO of LVMH, which owns Louis Vuitton, is the world's second wealthiest man of 2023, only after Elon Musk. His domain spans over 70 prestigious fashion and cosmetics brands, boasting ownership of esteemed labels such as Louis Vuitton, Christian Dior, and Sephora. Arnaud's journey to the heights of the fashion industry began unconventionally, starting his career as an engineer and property developer in his family's civil engineering firm in northern France. However, by 1984, his aspirations soared beyond construction. He orchestrated a series of ambitious maneuvers, envisioning a global enterprise he could command. His strategic takeover began with Bosac, a renowned but financially struggling French conglomerate Arnaud set his sights on a coveted gem within Boussac's holdings, the House of Dior. After divesting most of Boussac's other assets, he channeled the proceeds into his next luxury conquests, Louis Vuitton. This iconic French entity emerged in 1987 to form the powerhouse known today as LVMH. Number 2. LVMH? Or the Louis Vuitton Company? Is valued at $407.9 billion Louis Vuitton, a cornerstone of LVMH reigns as the world's most esteemed luxury brand. Renowned for its opulent array of leather goods, handbags, trunks, shoes, watches, jewelry, and accessories, often embellished with the iconic LV monogram, not just a symbol of elegance, Louis Vuitton stands as one of the globe's most profitable brands, boasting profit margins that soar above 30%. In a historic move after a seven-decade hiatus, Louis Vuitton ventured into the world of perfumery in 2016, marking the inauguration of its first fragrance line. Witnessing a dedication to craftsmanship, LVMH constructed a cutting-edge fragrance facility to craft these scents. The captivating actress Emma Stone starred in Louis Vuitton's debut fragrance film, adding allure to this new venture. Additionally, the brand expanded its fragrance line to include men's scents last year. As of December 2023, LVMH boasts a staggering market capitalization of $407.9 billion, securing its position as the 18th most valuable company globally. Market capitalization, also known as market cap, signifies a company's value traded on the stock market. LVMH's diverse portfolio comprises over 75 illustrious luxury brands spanning fashion, leather goods, perfumes, cosmetics, watches, jewelry, wines, spirits, and selective retailing. Among its notable acquisitions are Louis Vuitton, Christian Dior, Fendi, Celine, Marc Jacobs, Bulgari, Tag Heuer, Tiffany & Co., Ace and many others. Known for its history of acquiring and seamlessly integrating new brands, LVMH continues to evolve, expanding its prestigious collection of labels while maintaining an unmatched standard of excellence in the luxury market. Number 3. Bernard Arnault has an investment in Hermes. One of Louis Vuitton's biggest competitors, LVMH sparked waves in the luxury sector when it surprised industry insiders last fall by revealing its acquisition of a 17% stake in Hermes, later escalating its ownership to 20%. This move stirred contention, drawing resistance from the Hermes family owners and management, who regarded LVMH as an unwelcome threat. Patrick Thomas, the chief executive of Hermes, expressed reservations, 
indicating that while LVMH could be a shareholder, crossing the 20% threshold seemed excessive. Bernard Arnault, in defense of LVMH's actions, asserted that the conglomerate was ideally positioned to safeguard Hermes's cultural legacy and business in the long run. He emphasized that LVMH could offer Hermes numerous strategic and operational advantages without any reciprocal demands other than their presence as a shareholder. Hermes International, a revered French luxury goods manufacturer, consistently ranks among the most esteemed luxury brands globally. Renowned for its craftsmanship and prestige, Hermes stands as a formidable competitor to Louis Vuitton and holds a valuation exceeding $200 billion. Number 4. The Louis Vuitton CEO once owned a $73 million private jet in 2022. Bernard Arnault made a noteworthy decision to part ways with his $73 million Bombardier private jet after a swarm of Twitter accounts and thousands of people started meticulously tracking the aircraft's movements. Following the sale of his Bombardier Global 7500, Arnault revealed his new preference for renting planes whenever he engages in private air travel a choice that doesn't come cheap, averaging around $11,000 per hour for chartering a jet. During this period, Twitter accounts dedicated to monitoring the flight data of various celebrities, including Elon Musk and Taylor Swift, gained substantial traction online. In fact, two Twitter accounts have attracted a combined following of nearly 100,000 users because of this type of content. Arnault uses his Bombardier Global 7500 at least once a month. This expensive vehicle has unparalleled capabilities in the realm of private jets. With an astonishing range of 7,700 nautical miles, it stands as the business jet with the longest non-stop flight capability. This aircraft boasts substantial dimensions for a private jet, measuring 110.88 feet in length and 26.9 feet in height, with a wingspan stretching across 104 feet. Number 5. Bernard Arnault owns a $150 million mega yacht. The Louis Vuitton CEO boasts ownership of Symphony, hailed as the largest feed ship ever created, a testament to opulence in the realm of luxury yachts. Valued at a staggering $150 million, this mega yacht is a prized possession of Arnault. The superyacht Symphony features eight expansive staterooms capable of accommodating up to 16 guests, along with a comfortable facility that can house a crew of 27 on board. Additionally, it boasts a private deck specifically designed for the owner, catering to an envisioned total of 36 passengers. Crafted by the renowned Tim Haywood design, the exterior of the yacht exemplifies sophistication, while the interior aesthetics bear the signature touch of Zaretti interior design. Constructed as Project 808 by Feedship at the Royal Van Lent shipyard, Symphony stands as a pinnacle of nautical elegance and engineering excellence. Number 6. He has a collection of expensive artworks, including a Pablo Picasso painting. Bernard Arnault's profound passion for art is evident in his impressive private collection that spans both modern and contemporary art realms. His collection serves as a reflection of his discerning taste and appreciation for artistic innovation, showcasing works by some of the most esteemed artists globally. A significant part of Arnault's collection centers on contemporary art, featuring pieces by pioneering artists such as Jeff Koons and Damien Hirst, whose contributions have significantly shaped the art landscape. It's plausible that Arnaud's collection proudly exhibits iconic and groundbreaking artworks by these influential figures. As a proud Frenchman, Arnaud demonstrates a particular affinity for French artists, actively supporting and collecting works by talents like Philippe Pereno and Bertrand Lavier, all of whom have left indelible marks on contemporary art. Given Arnaud's discerning eye and penchant for quality, his collection likely encompasses iconic masterpieces that have garnered global acclaim. Works by renowned artists such as Pablo Picasso, Yves Klein, and Andy Warhol, whose artistic contributions are highly coveted in the art world, might find a place of prominence within Arnaud's collection. Number 7. Bernard Arnault owns a $200 million mansion. Bernard Arnault's opulent mansion, reportedly valued at $200 million, sprawls across a lavish 12-acre estate, encompassing a private lake, tennis court, and underground parking facilities. 
Situated in the 8th district of Paris, on the left bank of the Seine, this estate boasts a harmonious fusion of modern and classical architectural elements, boasting a sleek, minimalist interior design. This veritable palace spans over 7,000 square feet, including 12 bedrooms, 12 bathrooms, a library, a dining room, and a ballroom, catering to an extravagant lifestyle. Number 8. Bernard Arnault donated more than $200 million to repair Notre Dame Cathedral in 2019. Arnault has solidified his commitment to the restoration of the fire-damaged Notre Dame Cathedral in Paris by formalizing an agreement with the Foundation Notre Dame, pledging a significant donation of $200 million. His generous pledge was initially made in the immediate aftermath of the devastating fire that engulfed Notre Dame in April 2019, showcasing his dedication to aiding the cathedral's restoration. The substantial donation is set to be disbursed over multiple years, aligning with the ongoing restoration requirements. As leading benefactors, both Arnaud and the Foundation Notre Dame will play an integral role in overseeing the restoration project by serving on the committee tasked with monitoring and guiding the cathedral's renovation endeavors. This partnership underscores Arnaud's deep commitment to preserving the cultural heritage and historical significance embodied by Notre Dame Cathedral. As we conclude our fascinating journey through Bernard Arnault's world of luxury, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to stay updated on all things opulence. Your support means the world to us, and we look forward to sharing more captivating content with you in our next video. Until next time, stay curious. Exploring the pinnacle of luxury with Luxury Queen.